Hey guys, Windex here, and I'm going to be teaching you how to make mods in Left 4 Dead 2, but you already know that because you read the description, so we're going to jump right into it because I know you want the haste, okay? So you want to click on Properties, Old Browse Local Files, Left 4 Dead 2, Sounds, Player, Survivors, uh, Voices, and then choose any one of these characters, then you want to hit Control A. Control C so you can copy everything, but remember the entire thing up there, right? Do you, do, do you see that? Do you see those pathways? Keep that in mind because that will come in handy, trust me. So you want to go back and do left right at two, click on add ons, create your file. It can be anything you want, it can be memes for dead or whatever the hell you want it. And uh, mine's furries for dead because all my other friends are going to be voice acting this. I'm not a furry, by the way. Not a furry, okay? It's it's ironic, I swear. Okay. <laughs> so you want to go to furries for dead, sound, players, survivors, voice, and then any character that you want. Actually, I'm choosing Nick because Nickelodeon, hell yeah. And then you want to control V it into this entire thing and then you want to change you know all, all of the voice characters in there and now the reason why I told you to remember it to remember those paths of the previous files is because you want to mimic exactly the same path from the uh, thing here I don't know what you call it so that the game can find it can find the stuff you, you know you, you know how it is you know how it goes I don't have to explain it to you you just, you just do this and it works. That's all you need to know. So now you want to go to add-ons, left for the two, and then you want to drag it to this .vpk file, right? When you when you drag it there, it's going to make a VPK right here, and that VPK is going to work on your left for the two, guaranteed, right? But I know what you're saying. Windex, Windex, Windex. There is no VPK file there. I'm looking. There's no VPK file. I got you, fam. I got you, okay? No worries about that. So this is what you want to do. You want to go into Left 4 Dead 2, right? Wait, no, hold on. The other Left 4 Dead 2, my bad. <laughs> the bins. And then you want to go all the way down to .vpk, .vpk. You find this, you right-click, create shortcut. Then you want to copy that shortcut. You want to go back. Go into the left of two add-ons, and then you want to put the shortcut in here, and then you want to drag the file down to this thing. After you're done modding a few things in there, by the way, so it works. But now I'm thinking, I bet, I bet, you pause the video, right? You you've been doing everything hand by hand, but you don't see a VPK file. Where is the VPK.exe? Well, I got you covered. I should have done this better. <laughs> okay, so you want to go to tools, right? On your Steam library, you know, this library thing, you click on it, there's tools, and you can download a bunch of free shit, yeah, but the only free shit we care about is the Left 4 Dead authoring tool. So you want to download that bad boy, it's going to download it, it's going to, you know, put all the cool stuff that you can mod Left 4 Dead 2 with into the Left 4 Dead 2 bins folder, it's going to scram that bad boy in there, but... Let's just say you look back in there and it's still not there after you just downloaded it. Where did it go? Well, and that's all hope is lost, right? Well, not really. Because, because, because you can go to properties, verify integrity of game files, which should grab anything that's missing and just shoves it, shoves it right into that game and it should all be there. And then you can probably go into add-ons, thing, grab the thing, make it, and you know what it is. Now here's a fun little tip that if you guys are going to make mods for video games, or Left 4 Dead 2 in general, you want to go into the, you know, the freaking sound files, obviously, and try to find a stock one. I did most of these. I gotta find them. I'm trying to find one. I gotta find them. I'm trying to find one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Reaction. So, so, let's just say you, you have Audacity, you open it up, and you're like, oh, cool, I can just uh, record this, and uh, I'll be done with. There's a few things that you have to think about. So, it has to be exactly the same size, 
It can't be any bigger because it would cut you off. It can't be any smaller because it would slow down the volume and make it all low pitch. It's really weird. So you want to listen to the volume, listen to the sound file first. So like, is this some kind of sick joke? All right. Remember, remember, remember this. Is this some kind of sick joke? Re remember where the bars peak during every single bar thingy down here. Because that's going to come in handy. Because it, if you make it too quiet, no one can hear it. And it has to be exactly the same level. If it's too much, it's crackly. If it's too little, you can't hear shit. It's weird. It's so weird. So this is how you do it. You want to click on generate. Gen <laughs> generate silence. I messed that up. Okay, you want to overdo this thing. Generate silence. And then you want to make it a little bit bigger so you don't have to press stop recording after you're done. And he says, this is some kind of joke. That sounds a little bit too harsh, right? So I'm going to put into my own philosophy of my own character and see what he would say. So instead of saying, this is some kind of joke, he would probably say something like, are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Bam. Absolutely horrible, but I'll change it later. So you want to delete the access stuff, beam this thing up a little bit, you know, hoo, 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 this grain thing here, because this grain thing will make it louder, right? You don't want to go on to effects and amplify it, because amplify it would crackle up your voice. This would still crackle it up, but it would do a better job. Are you freaking kidding me? Right? So as you can see, the, the bars... Right? The, the, the bars there? ARE YOU FREAKING KIDDING ME?! Right? That's perfect. That's absolutely perfect. So it will be exactly the same sound, or at least close to the same sound as the original voice line would have it. So now, you want to hit Control, Shift, and E. And then you want to mash the Enter key, because it doesn't matter, legitimately. And then you want to go down, and it's going to make a dupe. I don't know why it does this. You just want to delete the duplicate, and then you can uh, close it, and then you can uh, freaking do everything that I said before. You, you, you know how it is, right? You know, you know. Bam. Just do that, and it works. You make it. It's made. It's done. You did it. Congratulations. You made a mod. And I have gone over literally every single problem that someone can have. And if you have more problems, just scream at me in the comments down below. And I'll try to help you. Desperately try to help you. Because I have no clue what I'm doing. And me and you are on the same boat here. So if you have a problem, I'm going to face it someday. And I'm, i got to fix it with you. That's, that's how it works. And if you want proof that this entire Left 4 Dead thing works... I'm going to give you proof. Hold up. Hey! Come back! Come back! Oh, he ain't coming back! Oh, but there's a chopper in this freaking thing! I don't care, I want to show... That was weird. Loaded. See, it worked. It worked. Loading. Alright, I'm gonna show you why. I'm gonna show you why. Loading gun. You need to uh, turn things up. God damn it, premium child. Stop it. Shit. Okay. You okay? Okay, I'm, I'm okay. So. Are you guys ready? Okay. Did you see this? Hell yeah. Pick the vomit. This, it sounds loud, right? Vomit out. I thought it was going to be quiet. You're going to be taking me somewhere. Somebody shoot him. Shoot him. Somebody. I should have moved. All right. All right. See, it worked. It worked. Down with the sickness. Oh, hey, guys. Wanna help me? No? Okay. Well, that's the mod showcase, and it works. I tried showing you what not to do, but it didn't work. So, bye!